SOS Limited had uh, what we consider to be um, not that of a bad day. <laughs> Considered all things together, what happened today? I mean, start overnight, Bitcoin and Ethereum and all the other cryptos as well, for that matter, dropping more than what 20%, 30% at a time. Incredible. And um, you will expect, I mean, personally, I was expecting today to be like oh, the worst, like maybe seeing one and a half dollar <laughs> on the share price. But it seems like this thing, you know, I mean, look at the candle, look at the candle right off the bat at the opening. Uh, seems like it's really, really, I don't want to call, use the term, you know, find the bottom, but it seems like there is a strong resistance around um, $3.20. So, guys, looking again at the competitors, Riot and... Um, uh, 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 um, a marathon digital uh, even ebay international you will see that today was even worse for them and it's been the case for so many days now in the last three uh, three weeks of the trading session so seems like you know sos is now getting a lot more attention from the market especially after the the, the, the data we did receive today i mean the the press release from the company which was expected uh, uh, weeks ago okay so they did announce today that they have now 6,000 mining rigs that they received over the past month and all have been now put into operation including a batch of 575 ethereum mining rigs received on may 7th so another batch of almost you know 5,500 rigs from the third and final installation of the rig purchase recent uh, received in april now they go here telling how it will increase, you know, the mining uh, 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 um, hash for Ethereum and also how it will impact the dominance or the scaling up of the business by SOS Limited. So definitely one, one thing that, which is really interesting to measure here is the fact that SOS currently gets over 90% of its energy for mining operations from renewable sources okay not coil not uh, 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 um, carbon dioxide not anything that will be damaging for the environment as you know this whole thing around cryptocurrency started with the third spreading started with uh, Elon Musk okay selling first of all he would not accept Bitcoin anymore for, te for, for, for uh, purchasing Tesla's but at a point implying that you know he sold Bitcoin and because of that because it was you know worse for the, uh, the, the environment and uh, uh, comparing it to, to, to the energy expense when you do mine coal which is totally untrue and since then you no know, Bitcoin and all the other cryptocurrencies except maybe for some icons have been struggling and, and, and really be, be getting being down but there is much more behind it and I think it's something that will give us confidence into holding uh, 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 the minor stocks such as SOS here because there are 21 million coins available I'm talking about Bitcoin okay and after Bitcoin on top of the I mean when it comes to the main uh, and the biggest market cap in the market for cryptos Ethereum is just after okay so it seems like much big banks are now trying to get into the crypto space but before that you know the big whales and you know the wall street guys and people with deep pockets they need to make sure they accumulate as much as possible and because bitcoin is have a limited offering have limited supply you know capped at 21 million and right now we are sitting at around 18 million so there's about 2 million uh, 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 coins to be uh, uh, um, um, put in the market and out of those 18 million available I think there's only 1 million being out for trading in the markets okay so they want to spook you know the little guy they want to spook as much you know investors holding as possible in order to scoop those coins you know and the uh, first thing that they would do is what we saw since last last month attacking the miners because it's much more easier to short these than it is to short the actual coins but with all the platforms coming now, like Coinbase and Binance and all the others, you are it's much more easier to manipulate the share price because you can do that through derivatives, okay? So that's why it's currently happening behind the scenes. But I do think once they decided that, you know, it's time for this to end because they will be comfortable with whatever price, you know, they'll be getting in in terms of accumulating as much as they can, then they will let this thing fly again. And of course, this thing also will pop. So Kathy Wood is still maintaining her 500,000 price target on Bitcoin, 10,000 price target on Ethereum. So um, as another 
strategists well known in Wall Street, you know, giving the price target of 125,000 for Bitcoin before the end of 2021. So Wells Fargo, I was reading this morning again, is now getting into the crypto space to offer, you know, cryptocurrencies as an asset to the wealthy that they manage money for. So again, guys, a lot of confirmation that um, this thing is definitely going through a rough patch now, but it's not the time to sell. At least that's what I think. And uh, I'm still bagging my, I'm, I'm holding my bags here. I'm down, what, 60% on this, but um, I do, I'm here for the long play. So if it's the case for you, definitely guys, I hope that this video will give you a little bit more confidence into holding and I definitely see this, you know, going to all time new high, new all time highs when it comes to um, the latter end of this year. So. We'll see.